World of Tank Blitzers, it's a little finger. Hey, I've got a did I win or did I lose sent in by A1 Steakman here on Normandy. Uh, you can see this is Supremacy Battle and uh, in the object 252U, which uh, we've talked about many times on channel as probably being one of the best tier 8 heavy premium tanks. Um, you know, if there was any one tank you know i would recommend um as far as a heavy goes it would be this uh primarily because of its really troll armor and we'll see that in effect here in this game as he takes the long way round to d uh, but i do like this spot here coming up uh, it's kind of a little bit sneaky you know, normally you would go through C, cap C, and then each side pokes around on the set heavy side. But uh, look at that. He catches both of them off guard and manages to bait that one bounce. And yet he says surprise. Um, they were not expecting that at all. They did still manage to capture D, um, but this is a great little um, spot here. You don't have to worry about the TD corner. Um, because he's so low profile and uh, just waiting for his opportunity here this is the one troll thing about the 252U is the gun is not as super accurate there uh, AMX he's going for it uh, can't imagine he's gonna last much longer kill shot on the HTC coming up let's let that aim in and make sure we don't miss that shot yep sure enough the AMX uh, is taken down and he spotted the issue in the corner um, and he's gonna go and uh, try to get a shot here again waiting on that aim time but a nice 400 damage roll there he's angling up towards the SU 100 here 101 um, but he's gonna tuck himself in and I felt like maybe he spent a little bit too much time here uh, ignoring his teammates between B and uh, D there. So he's going to turn it around and uh, try to help out. There's that uh, slightly inac inaccurate gun. Um, probably could have waited for the Yo to turn around and finish him off. But nonetheless, gets the kill shot. However, as you notice, one versus three. A T-34. Three's got some good life. E-25 is full health. And only one shot taken on the SU-100Y. So um, now is the time to hit that pause button. Go down below and say, is this a win or is this a loss? As he's angling himself up to all of these tanks, rushing him like crazy. Bounce, bounce, bounce. <laughs> And that's what I'm talking about. The troll armor on this tank is something else. And he's going to try to get to cover as he's now blocked 1,900 damage. Um, E25 now shooting his sides. Going to do some damage. But uh, the T34-3, guys, uh, something to note. Carries the same 120 millimeter gun. So his reload time is about the same as the Object 252U. So... Um, Doing his job here, getting the E25 taken care of. Now he's got 800 hit points to 1,000 on the T34-3 who bounced that last shot. Um, that would, I think, would have been the difference maker in this game had that T34-3 being able to get that shot down. Damaged engine, uh, trading shots now. Who's going to win out here? I'm thinking it's a two shot for either of them. And T34-3 there. Just takes too long to get that big shot in. I would imagine the 252U is going to reload first. And just enough time there to get the W. Um, nice little battle there. Fun tank, guys. Um, yeah, definitely worthy of an Ace Mastery, Kolobinov, Steel Wall, some serious carry going on here. Um, and then a tank that certainly allows you the opportunity to do so. 
So guys, with that, um, yeah, please don't forget, you can send in your close battles, your ace masteries to the Discord server, and uh, I'll try to do a better job this update of uh, getting more of those out there because they are fun to watch. So um, with that, have fun out there, guys. Stay safe, get educated, not fingered, little finger out.